Ever wondered what's causing our universe to expand at an accelerating rate? It's a question that has confounded scientists for decades. Our universe, it seems, isn't just getting bigger, it's getting bigger faster. But what could be causing this? The answer lies in an enigma we call dark energy. To understand this, let's use a simple analogy. Imagine a balloon. Now picture this balloon continuously inflating, getting larger and larger. This is a lot like our universe, but instead of air, it's a mysterious force that's pushing the universe to expand. Now you might be asking, why compare the universe to a balloon? Well, in the grand scheme of things, the universe behaves quite similarly. As the balloon inflates, every point on its surface gets farther away from every other point. This is exactly what we observe in our universe. Galaxies are moving further and further away from each other. But here's where things get interesting. If you were to inflate a balloon, you'd need to keep blowing air into it. Stop blowing, and the balloon stops expanding. The universe, however, doesn't seem to need this constant input. Instead, it's as if the universe is inflating itself from the inside. This is where dark energy comes into the picture. Dark energy, a term first coined in the late 20th century, is the force that scientists believe is responsible for this self-inflation. It's like an invisible energy field that permeates all of space, pushing it to expand. But don't let the name fool you. Dark energy isn't dark in the way you might think. In fact, it's completely invisible. We can't see it, touch it, or measure it directly. Its existence is inferred from the effects we see, the accelerating expansion of the universe. So, the mysterious force causing this continuous expansion of our universe is what scientists call dark energy. But what is this dark energy? Dark energy, despite its ominous name, isn't something out of a science fiction movie. On the contrary, it's a very real and very puzzling part of our universe. So what is dark energy? Well, it's a bit of a cosmic conundrum. In the simplest terms, dark energy is an unknown form of energy that exists everywhere and fills all of space. Think of it as the ultimate energy field, stretching out across the entire universe. It's not something we can see or touch, but it's there, and it's having a profound impact on the cosmos. Here's where it gets interesting. Scientists believe that dark energy is the driving force behind the accelerated expansion of the universe. That's right, our universe is expanding, and it's doing so at an ever-increasing rate. This wasn't always thought to be the case. In fact, up until the late 20th century, it was widely believed that the rate of the universe's expansion was slowing down. But observations of distant supernovae turned this assumption on its head and introduced us to the concept of dark energy. Now you might be wondering how does dark energy cause the universe to expand? Well, it's thought to be a sort of anti-gravity. Instead of pulling objects together as gravity does, dark energy pushes them apart. It's this push that's causing galaxies to move away from each other and the universe to expand. But here's the catch. While the concept of dark energy has been around for a while, and while it's widely accepted in the scientific community, we don't actually know what it is. It's a theoretical construct, a way of explaining observations that don't fit with our current understanding of physics. There are several theories out there, from it being a property of space itself, to it being a new, undiscovered particle. But as of now, dark energy remains one of the biggest mysteries in cosmology. Now that we've delved into the concept of dark energy, let's take a look at a paradox that baffles scientists. The vacuum catastrophe. Imagine making a calculation and your result is off by a factor of 10 to the power of 120. That's exactly what happened in the case of the vacuum catastrophe. Let's dive into the vacuum catastrophe, a monumental blunder considered the worst prediction in the history of physics. It's a conundrum that's directly linked to dark energy, the mysterious energy that's causing our universe to expand at an accelerating rate. To make sense of this, let's first understand what we mean by vacuum. In physics, a vacuum isn't just empty space, it's actually buzzing with activity, filled with fluctuating energy and particles that pop in and out of existence. This is known as quantum fluctuations. Now, according to quantum field theory, these fluctuations should contribute to the energy density of the vacuum. That's the energy that's present in every cubic meter of space. Here's where things get interesting. When scientists tried to calculate this energy density, they arrived at a number that was, well, astronomical. Their calculations suggested that the energy density of the vacuum should be about 10, followed by 120 zeros. It's a number so large it's almost impossible to comprehend. Yet, when we observe the universe, the energy density appears to be almost zero. This gigantic discrepancy between the calculated value and the observed value is what we call the vacuum catastrophe. 
It's like predicting the weight of a feather and getting the weight of a blue whale instead. So how does this relate to dark energy? Well, dark energy is thought to be a form of vacuum energy. But if the vacuum energy is as high as the calculations suggest, our universe should be expanding so fast that galaxies, stars, and even atoms couldn't form. Clearly, that's not the case. The universe is expanding, yes, but not that fast. We're left with a paradox. The calculations suggest one thing, but our observations say something else entirely. So, the vacuum catastrophe remains one of the biggest unsolved problems in theoretical physics. As we've seen, dark energy and the vacuum catastrophe are two of the universe's greatest mysteries that scientists are still trying to unravel. We've journeyed through the enigma of dark energy, the unseen force that's accelerating the expansion of our universe. We've also delved into the vacuum catastrophe, the astronomical discrepancy between the predicted and observed value of the energy in a vacuum. Both of these phenomena challenge our understanding of the cosmos, pushing the boundaries of what we know and what we think we know. But remember, our understanding of these phenomena is far from complete. We're standing on the frontier of knowledge, gazing into the unknown, Every theory, every observation brings us one step closer to grasping these cosmic conundrums. But there's still a long way to go, and many more questions to answer. As we continue to explore these cosmic mysteries, who knows what mind-blowing discoveries await us in the vast expanse of the universe?